It snowed again, and you get a bird's eye view this time. I have to think of something to make this rhyme. Okay, there we go. And uh, yeah, it snowed again. Uh, cliche, of course, but uh, I forgot to tell you in another vlog. Um, remember I said that uh, it's very unlikely that we would uh, see grass again for the rest of the year? Well, evidently Mother Nature made me a liar about that because uh, somewhere like in mid-December it was completely rained out. Like, somehow we managed to get rain in December. Yeah, December. And it wasn't snow, so it, it because it you know, the water is warmer than the snow itself. It melted it all, and we got to see the grass again. But anyway, that's uh, about it for this. I got other updates, so let's go back inside. And we're back inside like magic! Wow! Okay, I won't do that again. Okay, I won't do that either. And now for the updates. Anyway, I kind of feel bad about not having a game series going on my other channel daily as I usually do. But uh, I, I, I just can't find what I'm looking for on it. I don't want to give any false information or not give enough information about the game that I was thinking about doing. But I'm thinking about just canceling it altogether. Uh, I should say... I shouldn't say cancel, I should say stop researching the game that I'm that I was thinking about doing altogether because I'm basically not uploading anything except for rehashed um I should say remade older videos that needed some updates. So I guess in a way because I'm not doing game videos over there, it's it's kinda good because I can update some stuff that needs to be updated. But not good because there's no game series going. However, between working on the other game series on my other channel and uh, making those update videos, I've already got something set up for this channel, a little comedy series. Uh, you'll see a little update uh, as, as soon as I get something on this. Well, I shouldn't say get something on this, make something for this. You'll see what I mean when I make it. But I guarantee you, it'll be awesome. Boop! Boop! Ooh, ooh, I almost forgot to tell you! I was thinking about getting another camera. Yes, another camera. That would mean that I would have three cameras. Well, that sounds quite greedy, right? Well, I have my reasons, basically. Like, see what I'm showing you right now? My shoulder here? It's very, very likely noisy, uh, unless I edit the video itself. Like, you know, I can't even remove all the noise from the video, even in the editing. Like, uh, I've probably got it smoothed out right now, and in a second you're gonna see it change to a very noisy uh, picture, something like this. See how there's, like, noise uh, down here, as well as... Uh, uh, sheets over there as well, and also on the blue blankets uh, over there. Yeah, that's my camera basically. So every time I shoot something with this, you know, a video or something like that, I have to edit out the noise, and that gets kind of cumbersome, especially when I have to adjust it ever so slightly for each clip and each situation. Oh, and I should also add to uh, take a look at this image right now. And now take a look at the unedited images here. See how much darker and washed, well I shouldn't say washed out the colors there, it just looks a lot darker and it's not supposed to be. And that's another thing that I have to adjust is the brightness of it. Another reason why I want to get another one is for the family basically. Um, like during Christmas, I basically couldn't take pictures of anyone with this camera that I'm using right now even though it's the best camera I have. Because if you take a picture with it, if you're not perfectly steady while it's taking the picture, it doesn't have image stabilization or anything, it's going to blur. It's, and sometimes it even blurs on its own. Like, I've set it up on a tripod, I've done a bunch of tests with it, and it still blurs the photos and stuff like that. Which sucks, because you miss moments and stuff like that. In fact, if it wasn't for my mom's boyfriend, who got her a camera, which she let me use to take pictures for Christmas, I wouldn't have been able to take pictures at all. Plus, I also like photography. Obviously, if I miss an opportunity to make something artistic, I'm probably not going to get another shot at 
getting it again, you know, because the camera either blurred out or something goes wrong with it. So that's basically why I'm looking into getting one. Uh, I basically narrowed it, narrowed it down to two cameras, the Canon PowerShot S95 and the Canon PowerShot G12, which would fit my needs. I would prefer, like, to have a compact camera like those two. Well, the G12 isn't compact, but it's small. The reason why I like smaller is because, it's, you know, it's not as heavy, it's easier to handle, uh, it's, you know, it's not tiring to hold it up in the air for like minutes at a time then you start shaking all over like that even even a camera that's like only a pound would eventually start to wear on you if you just hold your hands all like this try to take a shot now that sounds really really nitpicky but when you're waiting for the right shot to happen you're, you're basically just sitting there literally like that with the camera waiting for the moment and waiting and waiting and waiting and sure enough you get tired out while well, your hands and arms get tired out from holding up a heavy camera <laughs> so that's why I prefer to have a pocket camera more than anything the camcorder that I'm using right now I guess is as small and as light as I would prefer to use but as I said it's not really ideal for taking pictures because it blurs things out so that's why I considered those two cameras but there is a small factor and that is the price the S95 and the G12 are, wait for it, $400 and $500 respectively. My first reaction to that was, <coughs> yeah, it's kind of expensive. So, why am I even considering buying them then? Because it it's like a one-time purchase thing. Like, you would only have to buy, well, I would only have to buy it once, and then I would never, ever have to buy another camera again, unless that would break. And I take care of my stuff really, really well, and very rarely does an electronic thing that I have break, even outside of warranty. So I, I keep them lasting even longer than the warranty that comes with whatever electronic thingy that I get. I don't have that many of them, but basically they're all in great shape. So when you look at it that way, you know, $400 or $500 for years to come doesn't really sound like all that much. Oh, and of course I'd want something that has good low-light performance because this camcorder or camera, you know, whenever I take a picture or just film something, if it, there's something dark, oh, it's not going to be very good unless I edit it. And even when I do edit it, um, using noise reduction editing tools basically degrades the quality of the video anyway. It blurs the video just slightly, but it makes it a little bit better at least. But I'll, I'll show you what I mean. Behold the fluffy blankets! Yeah, you see how noisy the picture is without editing? Now I'm gonna do a little editing thing here, and you'll see how much better it got. However, it's got blurrier, and I would prefer to, you know, shoot it right the first time rather than uh, edit it and degrade the quality either way, no matter which way I do it. Well, that's about all for this vlog, I guess. Not really that much to update on, but an update is an update. So uh, I guess I'll see you guys later. Hope you enjoyed.